Hello, Jonathan Landeros for Kativ Technologies. In this video, I'm going to show how the style libraries from a previous version of Inventor can be migrated into Autodesk Inventor 2014. This time, however, I'm going to do something a little bit different than I've done before. Instead of migrating all of my 2013 libraries to 2014 in their entirety, I'm only going to copy the styles that I've created. So I'm going to merge them with the libraries installed with 2014. The reason I'm doing this is to make sure that any improvements or changes to the 2014 libraries are integrated into my new installation of Inventor. So let's have a look at this. First, I'll go to my Windows Start icon, choose All Programs, Autodesk, Autodesk Inventor 2014, Tools, and Style Library Manager. I'll get two panes, Style Library 1 and Style Library 2. In Style Library 1, I'm going to browse out and locate a copy of my 2013 libraries. It's important to note that this is a copy and not the ones that are with my 2013 installation. Why have I done this? If I make a mistake, I still have the originals to go ahead and go back to to try again. And also, if I need to continue to use 2013 on a legacy project, I still have those styles safe and sound. Now, I'm going to go ahead to the second pane and browse to the location of my libraries for 2014. And this location is what's defined by your application options or by your project. Remember, if you designate it by project, that's going to take precedence over application options. I'm going to choose that location, which I defined in my project file in my case. And if I check dimension styles, in blue we can see my custom dimension styles. I've also got a couple of sheet metal rules that I also want to bring over. Now none of these will come over until they migrated, so I'll click the migrate button down at the bottom of the pane. Inventor will tell me it's going to migrate those, they're going to be migrated to the current release, and that it's going to take about two minutes or so to go ahead and do that. So I'll accept that and I'll let Inventor go ahead and migrate those libraries. And now, through the magic of video editing, we're going to speed up time a little bit. A dialog will come up announcing that the library migration is complete and I'll go ahead and click OK. And now there's one more step. I'm going to select my libraries, use Shift Select if it makes it easier, and move those over to my 2014 libraries. I'll do the same for my dimensions. I'm going to use Control left click this time and move those over as well. Now that that's completed, my 2013 libraries are converted to 2014 libraries and they're ready to go ahead and use in my new installation. That's it for this video. Thanks for taking the time to watch and I hope everybody's going to 2014 real soon.